Hello everybody, it's Van Berman here. Welcome back to another video today. Now, this might be minor spoilers, although I presume you probably won't be looking at it if um, if this isn't exactly what you're after. So, those of you that have done the battle at Pyrablislavitz, <coughs> that place, um, will know obviously you fight... Um, is his name Grunt? I can't remember now. Um, something. Something. Runt, maybe. That's it, Runt. Um, in the bell tower just up there. And obviously he's got a lot of fairly high level armor on. Especially for the point in the game that you're at. So if you want to go and get it, like I did. I was a bit disappointed that you weren't obviously... Well, I suppose you couldn't be being given the option to loot him. Um, then obviously I wanted to go back and try and get it off him. Now, the doorway is all blocked up. Away from the side you can't jump over. Um, and I was just messing around with the train just to see if there was any way of actually getting in there. Um, and I have discovered a way which I thought I'd just like to show you guys now. Um, so basically what you want to do is you want to get... So you're jumping on top of this bush here. So you're sort of aiming to get your character right around that bit there. And if you get lucky, like I did, although I'm not doing it now. Uh, there we, go. we will. You'll see it actually comes up with the use ladder um, prompt. So if you can catch that in time while you're jumping up here, which I will now attempt to try and do for the next 50 attempts till I hit it, then um, you might actually even be able to jump up on that from the uh, from the top of the bush potentially. So yeah, if not, you can always yeah press A and it will transport you onto the ladder, which is quite nice. So you can get around the back and go up through the window up there, and there's a chest there with 80 or 90 groschen. Um, there's not too much else, I don't think. There's nothing... I've not found anything in here. Um, there is a ladder... Oh, sorry, yeah, no, there's a ladder that goes up here, sorry. Um, which gives you... Which has got 90 grosh in it. I've not seen anything else on this bottom floor. And then you can, as you did in the battle, climb up to the top of the bell tower. I don't know if there's a way around the back or not. I haven't had a look, so I don't know. If there is, and this is... a then this happens to be a pointless video, then at least there's that. Uh, oh, there's something, there's a chest here. So I don't know what's going on, but my cursor's not showing for my lockpick, so it makes things a little bit more difficult. I sort of have to guess where it is, and then I think that I can, there we go, just about. Almost lost the lockpick on an easy lock there. Absolutely nothing in there, so. As to be expected. So then we go up here. Nothing. Oh, something in there. A cabbage. So yeah, if you want to get, if you especially short on cabbages, there is one here. And we go up to the final one. Now I've already looted him, so I actually just started back from the beginning uh, of the well, well, from the start of this video actually, just to show you guys where they. Oh, there's two cabbages. Where you can go, how you can get up here. So my or my guy was down here on the floor in bits. Uh, wearing all his armor. I can't find his sword. That seems to have vanished. Uh, there was a shield up here as well, though. Uh, a cumin shield, which is just here. Um, which I've taken. I don't think there is anything else. But yeah, here he is. In all his glory. Just just classed as a bandit now, at this point. So I'm just going to drop him out of the window. Am I? Hmm. Maybe I'm not allowed to drop him out the window. That's annoying. Yeah. Oh well, you'll have to lie there then. So yeah, you can obviously then loot all his stuff, go back all the way down the clock tower. I've already saved, so we're just going to take the hits to my health. Down here. Oh, I don't actually take any. Just stamina damage. And then you can literally just climb up the ladder, obviously, and then jump off. And you did. Like I say, I don't know if there is a way around the back. I haven't checked the whole perimeter. I just wanted to find the easiest way just to get up there. In terms of other stuff in the camp, I've not found anything of worth that's take that's worth taking. So, yeah. Nothing really too much to report on that. And other than that, that's about it. So I hope this helped maybe one or two of you wanting to find out how you get back up there. Just a bit sneaky with the whole jumping thing. I think it looks like they've almost made it so you can. I mean, it's in quite a obvious position. You've got the mound there of the, the bushes and then you've got the recess of the wall as well so it does sort of lend itself to being, a, being able to get back up through that way. 
Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video, and I'll see you all very soon. Goodbye.